reverse grip, not only can I draw it faster, like this knife I carry right here. Okay, go ahead. See, quicker draw mm -hmm. because all I have to do is grip and go. Mm -hmm. I don't have to pull <coughs> and go. Mm -hmm. I can just pop. Okay, number two, it's easier for me to get into a thrust. See, with structure. Okay. Even if I block it, you just tap it. Boom. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Boom. What we were working on. Okay. Number three, mm -hmm. quicker draw, structure, mm -hmm. quicker thrust. Okay. It works better in close, which is where we want to be. Right. Remember, I've worked you guys for years now on getting in close. So even if he wants to stay out there mm -hmm. and he does his, his, his slash, whatever, see, I disable that. I've got him here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Huh. Yeah. And go all singer sewing machine on it. <laughs> I also thought when you're doing it and you're in close and you're here without the finger grip, you're just doing this, he comes in. Right? I'm doing this, it feels like you don't have as much control or strength in the actual movement versus there's no way he's getting this out of my feet. No. Well, well even doing. without the fingering? Yeah, yeah. But here, use a regular size trainer. Forward grip first. Uh -huh. Okay. Give me a slash. This will demonstrate from a slash easier. Okay. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, even if I cut my own fingers, we're right. even now. Right. Whereas if you do it in reverse grip, see? Yes, it feels like it's never going to If my out. If my timing's off, well, I get it. Yeah. And, and this is going against somebody who, who's trained enough to know what they're doing. Right. If you're in forward grip, mm -hmm. I got that. Right. You saw what happened. Right. Boom. Boom. Right. right? In reverse grip, you yeah. are stronger. Yeah. Okay, especially like if you're capping better. Yeah. Right? Plus, I have that whole edge right there that I got to deal with, yeah. which means I'm screwed. Right. Okay. No, but reverse grip is stronger from a retention standpoint. Mm -hmm. Also, to do any real close in work, right. forward grip, I have to use a lot more of my body, which is a good thing. Right. It's a good habit to get into. Yeah. But with reverse grip, I can sneak into areas <laughs> because of the, just the manipulation of my wrist and I have good strength with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, body weight to that, that's going to go too. way deeper. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but with reverse grip, I can make smaller motions and get big results. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, and that also builds on the strength. The other reason it's stronger is because when you're like this, your wrist is not as lined up well as it should be. Now with the grip, it doesn't matter because it becomes part of your skeleton. But with a regular knife, your wrist isn't as lined up as well. Look at the difference. Yeah. You can see it in the, the how my wrist is lined up with mm -hmm. the bones better and everything, right. and plus how solid it is. Mm -hmm. And plus, mm -hmm. even if I launch a surprise attack and you, you stop me, right? Right. You stop me. Right. Yeah. I have <laughs> versus. Yeah. See? yeah, and I'm going back at the other way. There's, I, and even if I, I can get an annoying <laughs> scratch, me. Right. I can't get anything deep versus if I'm here. Boom. See. Mm -hmm. Okay, <laughs> so I'm not going to say reverse grip is better than forward grip. They both have their place, mm -hmm. but with the way we work, I think reverse grip is better. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And it's also sneakier. I can walk around with a knife in my hand if I feel something's unsafe. I can have a small knife in my hand ready to go. If he's accosting me, he doesn't see the knife. <laughs> yeah, that was him right there. Right there. Oh, he no, 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 I'm right here. I already got he it. He was already yeah. getting me. <laughs> That's why I was like, oh. <laughs> and don't forget, just because there's not really an edge there, the point will rip the shit out of whatever you hit, too. So if he throws a number one or two, I don't care. Right here, I got him trapped. If I just retract that, I rip the shit out of his arm. I'm kind of filleting him because that point's digging in. Mm -hmm. Okay. There's a lot of advantages to it. To get that same motion out of a forward grip, I have to come this way. <laughs> it's not as easy and it's not as easy. It takes more timing. Whereas, ah! <laughs> <laughs> and that wasn't no power either. You saw I didn't do anything. Yeah, All I did was. In the right Poof. spot. <laughs> So that's just that a, quick de <laughs> a quick demo. I cut your face off and wear See? Here. And the same thing works Our without shit. a knife. <laughs> Come on. See? I have that same motion with the reverse grip with a pen. Okay? Yeah. That would just. <laughs> <laughs>
which is why I like reverse grip, whether it's edge in, edge out, whatever, double edge, it's because it transfers to a lot, a lot of different tools. It transfers from knife, right? <laughs> Have a pen in my hand. See, same motion. Or, go ahead. Ouch. See? Did you punch him in the shoulder? I didn't punch him. That was a forearm blow. At least it wasn't the base of the. He twisted. Spine. It was his fault. Yeah. He hey, fell wrong. That's fine. At least it wasn't the back of your skull. Yeah, I got him bad one time. He was tasting brain food, it seemed like. Okay. <laughs> but see, the same motion applies no matter what tool I'm using. And that's why I like reverse grip so much. Same thing goes. First entry from Zulfa Kari 1. See? First move, he's dead. You want to stand over here so you can see what I do? Go ahead. First move, he's dead. Reverse grip, I got that cut. Then, the second, move. second move, maybe I take that arm as the third move, the elbow. I cut that arm. Now, hammer, right? Same. And he's going for the second set of movements. <laughs> See? Reverse grip is very important, especially in C-Lot. Except, just from a tactical perspective, so you got a problem with me? <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean you can't see anything. Yeah. <laughs> You're... Versus... It's even better if I'm like this. Mm -hmm. Ow. <laughs> I am very point-oriented, by the way. Yeah. I like the thrust. <laughs> oh I specialize God. a lot in edge in, but the motions are identical. If I have the edge in... Yeah, you do. <laughs> That's a cut. If I don't have an edge in, it's a hook. But see, the thing is, is I'm not so much concentrating on slashing and cutting you as I am thrusting. Yeah, because you got control. Well, not just that, but like I said, thrusts are stronger. Right. Okay, if I'm trying to cut here, I'm not going to get anything. The same energy for a thrust yeah. is going to get through. And it's more damaging. That is. Okay? <laughs> and not just that, but if I thrust here, that's a cut inside. If I rip that out, that's a bigger cut than if I just slashed across. It's deeper and does more damage. Okay. see what I was eating. Cop salad. Whereas, I can do the same thing forward grip, but I don't get that same kind of damage inside, and it's harder for me to do that rip out because of the positioning on my wrist and all that shit. I'd have to actually... Yeah, try it So... That's my little lecture on the superiority of reverse grip, in my opinion. Like I said, both are important to know, okay? Especially if he's staying out there, I don't get a chance, mm -hmm. right? And I can snipe him, right? But the minute he starts breaking, <sighs> another important tip. You see, I taught you that manual dexterity drill. We flip from here and spin, flip, do spin, it. right? <laughs> don't do that, A, in a, in a fight. fight. No. And B, if you're gonna do it in a fight, don't do it here, because what's he gonna do? Snap it. It's gone. Yeah. Or okay, if I need to knife. change my grip, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. behind me. Do that again, Terry. And forward grip, I wanna change to reverse grip. See? Behind me, he can put all the pressure on this side he wants, right? I can still, you know, pressure, give me pressure. See, no matter what he's doing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Whereas if I'm up here, <laughs> trying to do the same thing, see, it's gone. Okay, so well, that's my point of reverse grip. Mm -hmm. I have a lot more, I feel more comfortable with it. Ergo, I'm going to teach it to you guys more intense. Mm -hmm. Okay, even if he gives me just a straight number five thrust. See, the timing is a lot easier than having to go... See, you know, I have to take care of and that one in the forward grip. Yeah. I still end up with my knife point down. Right. So why not just start that way? Boom. The timing's a lot easier and a lot better. Your structure's still intact. Yep. 
Did he whisper in your ear? <laughs> The other thing you might want to think about is some different little tricky grips, I call them. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> now this one, you do run the risk of driving the point into your own wrist, mm -hmm. but it's important to know this kind of shit. Mm -hmm. He comes in, right? I don't care how. See? So there's the weakness. But. If I keep a good grip on it. Oh, oh. <laughs> Poor like Thomas. <laughs> kind of like a razor. Yeah. Between the fingers. Or like this. How do you hold it? What I was doing there was like this. Like that. Or you can do the drunken thing. Yeah. So the here. This, this is this is the true That's razor grip. This is from like actual straight <laughs> razor fighting. It's holding <laughs> shit like this. <laughs> Who's this? That was Johnny's. That was a little different. <laughs> so you have to yeah. have some kind of hold on with his thumb. So, basically, oh, it's it's slapping. Ah. There you go. 